Okay, I'll be I'll be honest. I'm completely out of the loop. Why why did this happen? I want some rest. Are we having fun yet? All right, so we're going to be looking through this article. Apparently, the Spurs met with Texas coach Rodney Terry. I I don't know why. Um, so uh, so the Spurs apparently went to uh, Austin, met with Chaboy Rodney Terry, and let's just read through this article and, and see why they actually did this. I I don't. I, I don't I don't know. I mean, I know that the Spurs were trying to expand out uh, to Austin a little bit. Um, you know, a lot of Spurs fans dismay, but I don't know. Uh, we'll, we'll read over it. Um, if you guys want to support the channel, clanthemerchfan.com or become a patron, a YouTube member, only $2 per month. All right. Okay. I'm really tired. I'm, I'm going to muscle through, though. All right. Woo. Okay. Um, by the way, a lot of you guys don't know this. I actually have a full time, like people think that all I do is YouTube. I have a full time job. Okay. I'm, I am busy. All right. Um, so yeah. So a lot of times when I get to these videos, I'm, I'm, I'm exhausted, but it is what it is. All right. Let's see here. When the San Antonio Spurs declared last year that they wanted to build their brand in Austin, they weren't kidding. Uh, yeah. Uh, not only has the organization sold a big chunk of the business to Austin, uh, computer guru, uh, Michael Dale. They played two home games, home games, at the brand new swanky uh, mood center last season and will continue to do so for the foreseeable future. The club has been sought uh, uh, permission from the city of San Antonio to play more games in Austin, Texas. We know that. Uh, the Spurs' uh, latest commitment to Austin came Tuesday in sending uh, a contingent up I-35 for a chat with a staff member or with staff members of the men's and women's teams at the University of Texas. Newly minted Hall of Fame coach Greg Popovich and Brian Wright and R.C. Buford. Wait a minute. I thought, wait, I did, I saw some photos. I saw some photos. Maybe we can, okay. Do I, oh, they're down here. Okay. All right. I did see, I did see something. Okay. I do know, know a little bit. I don't know. Maybe. Um, let's see. And Mono Ginobili was there. Basically, that's all I was saying. The Spurs went there to swap stories, share knowledge, give tips, etc., to a wide-eyed Terry who proudly boasted uh pictures on his instagram page oh so that's why they were there okay so the spurs just being awesome like they are so there's popovich okay all right so that's a spurs coach that's a spurs coach i'm assuming that's a spurs co hey, chat or, or comment section can you please tell me who this who this is i know them too who is that? Am I am I missing something? I don't know. Maybe it's like the camera. I don't know. And then I think that's Popovich. I think I think that's Greg Popovich. I'm not I'm not 120 percent sure, but I, I'm a, I'll put four dollars on it. Um, and let's see. Now this this was this was an image I saw. So you can see Brian Wright, Mono Ginobili, um, Boris Diaw. I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> um, okay, cool, good stuff. Oh, there's Greg Popovich. And there's RC over there. Oh, I didn't mean to do this, but hey, we're on his stuff now. Let's see. Okay, there's RC. Oh my goodness. I, I don't care what you guys say. RC looks scary. I'm sorry. He is a scary looking man. I don't know. I don't care what you guys say. Is he awesome? Yeah, I love RC, but he's still scary. He scares me a little bit. All right, moving on. Let's see. This was the first of what will become an annual staff clinic, but oh, between the Spurs and the Longhorns. Okay, San Antonio didn't decide to do this because... They are uh, UT fans. This is simply another tactic in building their brand in Austin. Mm. At some point, San Antonio and Austin will become a megaplex, such as Fort Worth, Dallas. The Spurs are making sure that they are way uh, out in front of it. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Okay, cool. All right. Yeah, that's actually really smart. Nice. Nice. That actually makes me happy. Um, who wrote this article? Mike Taylor. Mike Taylor, guys, shout out to Mike Taylor at uh, Fan Nation or SI. Doc. I get confused with these. Uh, uh, Sports Illustrated? I don't know. Yeah, but shout out to Mike Taylor. Good stuff. What else have you written? Hey, looking good, my boy. Let's see. Spurs defense must improve. Curtis Spurs after. Oh, okay. Yeah, we've we've seen we've seen some of his stuff before. Wait, no, we didn't see that. Good stuff. Good stuff, my boy. We got to go over more of this guy's articles. I, I, I like that. Anyways, I'll give it to you guys later. Till next time. Bye.